This is probably going to be pretty bad. Good morning, everybody. I'm Adam Bilsing, and this is the Oregon Drum Project, where we do daily deep dives into every aspect of playing the drums. Today is day 120, and our topic is brushwork. Repeat, 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 repeat. So if you'd like to follow along with me today, I'm doing some exercises out of a DVD called The Brush Secret, and I'll be running them at 48 beats per minute, specifically the full circular motion exercises. That's what I'm working on out of there. So without a lot more talking, let's get to work. All right, here we are over at the old snare drum. We're doing brushes today, so I have a real snare drum up. It's kind of nice. And I wanted to talk about repeating, repeating, basically. So I'm still working these full circular motion uh, exercises out of the Brush Secret DVD. And the reason I'm still working on them is because they're still pretty rough. Sometimes when you're practicing something that's very new or very difficult, it's gonna take a lot of repetition before it's under your hands effectively and before everything is sounding the way that you want it to. So my topic today really is just keep up the repetition if you need to. Sometimes I think of it like the gym, you just gotta do a lot of reps, a lot of reps before you get your hands feeling and sounding the way that you want them to. So I'm still running, like I said, full circular motion exercises. I'm doing inwards or the wax on motion with the right hand on top, outwards, wax off with the right hand on top, and likewise inward with the left hand on top and outward with the left hand on top. So today, as a show of solidarity, I'm gonna play my least favorite pattern, the one that I'm the worst at right now, and you can see why I'm still doing these same circular motion patterns several weeks later. And my least favorite is wax off, outward motion, with the left hand on top. And I'll be doing the acceleration accents instead of the pressure accents because those are the ones that are the most difficult. So here we go, my least favorite pattern and the one that I'm really the worst at right now. So you can see why I'm repeating, repeating, repeating. All right, so that about does it for day 120 of the Oregon Drum Project. 
That's 120 days in the bag working towards my ultimate goal of ecstatic improvisation through technical mastery of the drum set, which just means I want to freak out real good behind the kit. Special thanks today, as always, to my video producer, Mr. Silas himself over at Red 11 Media. Also shouts out today to Remo Drumheads and Ludwig Drums, because I got to play on the actual snare drum with the brushes. If you'd like to follow along and make sure you don't miss any episodes of the Oregon Drum Project, go ahead and like and subscribe below. You can also follow me over on Twitter, at Dirty Bandana, on Minds, again, at Dirty Bandana, and now on Reddit, at Dirty Bandana Drums. And of course, if you want to catch all the details for everything about the Oregon Drum Project, head on over to DirtyBandana.com. That's it. We'll see you all tomorrow.